Okay, hello, and welcome to page 9 of my graphic novel of comic strips titled Found Earth. This is volume 2. Uh, had a busy, busy week. Um, got to hang out with with Joe Lambden, uh, and we walked around downtown, saw some, some cool stuff, uh, the toy store with the figurines and the comic book shops with all, uh, one with all the rare stuff and one with just a huge collection of back issues to look through, and so that was a lot of fun to catch up with him. Let's see, this, uh, yesterday, since I'm filming this on Sunday, recording this on Sunday, and, uh, cutting it really close to the deadline, uh, went to Lexington Comic Con, and that was a whole lot of fun. It was, uh, it was not as crowded as last year. It was interesting. The people there were pretty cool. Uh, met lots of friendly people, uh, lots of cool cosplay. Uh, the guests that I got to meet were, were really exciting to me personally. Uh, got to meet David Bench and... Azarello, who wrote uh, Dark Knight 3, uh, also got to meet uh, Kevin Conroy, who does the voice for Batman for just about everything, including the animated series and most of the animated movies. I think he's been with Batman almost as long as Mark Hamill has. So that was a lot of fun to do. I got a couple of sketch covers, and they were just awesome. And Appreciate them. Gonna hang those on my wall. If you want to check them out, they'll probably be on my Instagram later. Uh, so, yeah, that was that was my day. We had one day passes to Saturday at Lexington, and so we got up at five o'clock in the morning and we drove down and we got there early enough that we were first in line for just about everything. Uh, also got a picture taken with Billy Piper, uh, me and my daughter. Uh, my son just kind of walked around and did what he did, and he had fun, and enjoyed himself off on his own. Uh, so it was, it was well organized, and it was, uh, it was a good con. Uh, good job, Lexington 2019. That's, that's the way to do it. I think they let fewer people in, and they had the lines better organized, and it was good. It was really good. Uh, okay, so back to this page. This is where the uh, hunter uh, takes the robots back to his home and introduces the robots to the woman that lives there and the kids and since uh, they're robots from another uh, another place they don't use the word wife I guess they use the word mate and so we have this uh, reunion between the, uh, the cave man and the cave woman and also they, the robots get introduced to the pets and the, and the kids and you have to be, uh, yeah, you have to be careful uh, petting other people's pets because sometimes they don't, they don't appreciate that, and sometimes they're protective those. So you have to uh, be careful when you meet other people's pets. I don't know how far that goes as, as a real lesson for uh, the, the entire page, but it makes for some humor. You have, you know, the curiosity and then the sudden bite. And, uh, the big explosive yell of pain, so uh, that's that's probably what you get as far as humor goes today. I'm starting off drawing with a number two, regular number two pencil. Uh, I think I, at this point, still had my carpenter's pencil misplaced. I'm not sure what was going on there. I've since gone out and bought like four four carpenter's pencils, so I should not have this problem again. Here's hoping. Uh, those should last me well into uh, the next project. <sighs> so, there we go. Uh, got to meet a lot of people, got to talk to a lot of people. Um, 
just working on uh, panels. Um, I had half a thought to go see Jeff Smith in Columbus today, but after all the running around yesterday, I'm quite frankly exhausted and tired, and um, I, j I just don't have it in me to do that right now. So I'm going to record this, upload it, and take a nap, I think. That's the kind of state I'm in. Uh, I didn't even, uh, because of the trip yesterday, I did not do a drawing yesterday. So if you look on social media for the 23rd of March, uh, 2019, you won't find anything because uh, there's nothing to find. I didn't upload anything uh, as far as drawing goes. I'll get back into the swing of it again uh, probably Monday night, maybe tonight. I don't know. Um, depending on how I feel at work. Because I've been, I've been doing a lot of drawing and posting on Instagram at my lunchtime at work. So, we go from there. We do. These pages took uh, a little bit of time because uh, drawing all the... Uh, all the people and all the robots and keeping them in proportion. Um, it would have been really useful to, to do this with with the carpenter's pencil, but I may do and I got it done. And so we move, we, we get it done. That's what we do. Uh, we, you know, as, as the page progresses, we get more and more of it done. Um, We'll get. The inking is always something that takes uh, an incredibly long amount of time, and I've been thinking about that. And I'm wondering if I should go with a looser, sketchy style to get that part done quicker. I don't want to not match the rest of the page, so I'm probably going to stick with uh, the standard uh, line art that I've been coming up with. In the penciling process, I found that if I can't get a shape correct, it's, it's best to try to work it out on uh, a separate sheet of paper. I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do with these uh, thumbnail pages. I think I think I'm going to um, if I do a Kickstarter, if, if I do a Kickstarter, uh, I think I'm going to use them as Um, you know, a stretch goal. Probably, you know, to put in the back of the book or maybe publish as a second book. I'm not sure. I think it would be interesting to have them in the back of the book and work 